Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan and on this channel you will find financial, travel and more videos. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Thank you. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll talk about how to have a free airport lounge access and how to sign up for the airport lounge program called Lounge Key. So before I start that, uh, let's talk about uh, the first thing, how to have free airport lounge access. So you can access an airport lounge by two ways. Uh, if you have a business class or first class flight, then you get free access. You don't have to do anything. However, you don't have a business class or first class flight, then you can uh, access lounge by paying for that lounge at the gate. That's one way. And then there's the other way is that you can have uh, credit cards which offer free lounge accesses and that's uh, th that's how you don't have to pay anything. So there are uh, free credit cards which usually gives you like you know four lounge accesses, six lounge accesses or some of them will just give you the lounge pass but each time you enter you have to pay a one time fee uh, at the gate. So I recommend having credit cards which uh, come with free lounge accesses and today I'm going to show you a little bit about how to sign up for one of the programs which, which is called MasterCard Airport Experiences provided by Lounge Key. Now on the Canadian credit card markets uh, a few of uh, credit cards give you uh, work with this uh, Lounge Key program. So the sign up I'm going to be doing today is with my uh, BMO World Elite MasterCard which gives you lounge key lounge access so it comes with the an annual membership plus four free lounge passes so what it means that uh, you can access lounge four times and if you uh, exit uh, the four passes then you have to just pay again each time you enter any lounge uh, some other credit cards for example the brim world elite mastercard or rogers uh, world elite mastercard they only uh, give you the membership but not any free passes so you have to just pay each time when you enter the lounge and usually it runs from uh, something like $27 to $31 I'm not exactly sure about the number but it's in that range uh, there are two airport lounge programs uh, are the, the most uh, two popular programs which are the priority pass uh, lounge access program and then uh, the one you're looking at right now is the lounge key lounge access program some credit cards use uh, priority pass and some credit cards use uh, lounge key the main difference between priority pass and lounge key is that uh, priority pass has a little bit more access uh, a more a little bit more lounge uh, access or more airports covered than a lounge key however both of these are the same company or their parent company is the same and they are owned by the same parent company and uh, the another difference uh, with the priority pass is that if you do not have a credit card you can um, sign up for priority pass by going to their website then they have different plans uh, for example they have like you know uh, just the pass uh, annual membership fee or they have like you know free uh, passes uh, with another plan certain numbers of free passes and then they have one plan which is unlimited however with the lounge key uh, lounge key lounge access program you will not be able to sign up unless you have a credit card which offers that program so this is not for general public without a credit card but for uh, priority pass you can sign up even if you don't have a credit card that is offering you a priority pass lounge access program so if you have a, a lounge key uh, credit card provider uh, the first thing you're going to be doing to in order to sign up uh, for the program is that search google by entering lounge key and this is going to be your first match mastercard airport experiences and then if you click on that then it will take you to the website uh, where you need to be signed up uh, so in order to sign up here you will have to uh, have your credit card because you have to enter that number and then uh, you know it will give you uh, send you an email uh, to activate the account so the first thing you do you just uh, uh, click on the create your account section and then uh, you enter your credit card number right here and then you have to just you know complete some other information and then once you uh, you know completed everything that you receive an email in the email box uh, then which you have to click on that email to verify your account so once you verify your account you're done uh, it will uh, show you how many you know lounge access you have or how many you have used so far and it will even give you a link to um, 
install the app on your phone which is recommended because you know it's gonna be handy uh, to enter the lounge if you have the app on your uh, phone another uh, minor difference with the launch key and the priority pass is that uh, if you have launch key access program you don't need to have any membership number you have to just present your credit card and then uh, they will be able to check it and let you in but with priority pass you have to present them with your either digital or priority pass membership card or physical uh, priority pass membership card now uh, i love staying in lounges at the airports and then i have uh, actually uh, lounge videos from around the world uh, which uh, i'll provide you a link below in the description box and you'll be able to see see some of the lounges i have visited visited so far so this is a, just a, an experience you don't want to uh, you know uh, pass by uh, because uh, at lounges you can have unlimited free food drink uh, shower some lounges uh, even have hotels inside the lounge for example if you look at my uh, turkish airlines lounge uh, in istanbul then you'll see that, that they do have uh, they have hotels inside the lounge where you can sleep uh, or you can just rest uh, so lounge provides a uh, lot of benefits and this just adds to a different dimension uh, to your total trip experience so before lounge airport is just like you know a airport experience would be just something you don't want to go through or you just want to pass uh, uh, the time to get to the plane but once you have lounge access then you want to stay more at the airport or you have to enjoy the lounge more and you know check out all the all the offers and food and everything they have to offer so that's all for now on this channel I do uh, travel videos uh, business class review videos lounge videos and all other videos uh, videos on great reviewers and points tips and other uh, travel related and credit card related uh, issues so if you like what you see please give it a thumbs up and subscribe because uh, there will be more videos coming up and I do have a uh, one month trip coming in within uh, two weeks very shortly uh, i'll be traveling to australia new zealand singapore and malaysia so i'll bring you lots of business class flight reviews and launch reviews so don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you shortly thank you